Message. Message. I need, 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 oh, it's easy, so easy, yeah, love. Welcome back to my channel. It's Shelby. Thank you so much for tuning in. In this video, I'm going to give you five quotes to remember when things get rough. So if you're interested in this video, stay tuned. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Peace out. So this is something that I've wanted to do on my channel since I started my channel. Um, I wanted to be an inspiration to people out there that are going through things. Um, because I don't think that it's talked about a lot on YouTube. Um, but I don't know. I just wanted to share some of the things that help me whenever I'm going through it. Okay, so the first one I wanted to share is your obstacles and your mistakes are your greatest teachers. This is something that I'm recently learning and it's got me so lit. I say that because of how strong I've become. So whenever I'm faced with something, initially I have a whole mental breakdown, which I am working on. But then I pull myself together. I switch my thought process to, okay, what is this trying to teach me? What is this showing me? What can I learn from this? And then I act accordingly. For example, earlier this year, when I initially got the kids back, um, I was rooming with someone and the living situation just wasn't working out anymore. It was rough as hell. I thought I was going to lose my mind. I just had to sit down and analyze and find a solution to that problem and then move forward from there. And looking back now, that taught me, one, to stop disregarding my intuition. I knew damn well, but I was like, no, nah, that... That won't happen, and it happens. So, and ask me if I ever disregard my intuition again. <laughs> nah. <laughs> that showed me that even through the toughest times, um, I've always found a way. And that kind of comforts me now, um, because it's like, okay, okay, you low key, high key, you the shit, you the shit. And so the next quote is. You don't just wake up and become a butterfly. Growth is a process. I am such a microwave person. If I don't see instant results, then I'm like, okay, whatever, I'm done with this. And that's another thing that I'm working on. But just imagine a caterpillar going through the process of becoming a butterfly. The cocoon phase to be exact. Now you may feel like you're going through the darkest phase of your life and you've already given up not knowing what's right around the corner. And I know you're probably like, God, come on. What's taking so long? Two. Talking about he may not come when you want him, but he's right on time. What time is it? I mean, what time is it? Two, what time? I can't. I but trust every part of your growth process it will turn into something beautiful next quote is the same energy you put into your relationships your parenting put that into yourself as well and this is something that i have to tell myself too you know i think that the world would be a better place if we invested the same energy that we put into you know our relationships and our parenting skills if you're if you're not a parenting but like the same good energy that you put out into the world you need to you have to it's important to also put that into yourself being loving to ourselves even though we fall short and disappoint ourselves saying sweet things to ourselves in the morning time or whenever throughout the day spending time with ourselves correcting ourselves when we're wrong i mean the list goes on and at the end of this life we are who we leave with and wouldn't you like to know that you did good for yourself as well as for others so treat yourself nice you know do something nice for yourself take yourself out you know, run yourself a bubble bath and relax. Like, do this often. Get into the habit of loving on yourself, too. You know, love yourself, man. Treat yourself right. Okay, the next quote is, stress and problems are going to knock on your door every day like, Hello, it's me. I was wondering if after all these years you'd like to me to go over everything but it's up to you to open it hello hey you yes you don't open that door it's like y'all don't 
don't answer the door for unexpected guests. It's your choice. Stop giving those negative situations, stop giving problems your energy. Not today, not today, not today. And the last quote I'm going to leave you guys with is, and here you are living despite it all. Let's take a second to give yourself a round of applause. Look at you. Seriously. You are making an effort, even the smallest effort, to keep going. Look back at all the things you've been through that you thought would break you and it didn't. Come on, man. Look at you, girl. Boy. Whatever. <laughs> no, for real. Like, give yourself credit. Okay, you have been through a lot. You've been doing the best that you can with, okay? You'll get there. Don't doubt yourself. Stop doubting yourself. You are way stronger than what you think you are. For real. I'm serious. I'm proud of you. For real. Oh, that was not the last quote. This is the last quote, for real, for real. This is the last quote, for real. If you're not where you want to be in life, why are you chilling so much? Huh? Why? Why? What you waiting on? Make a plan right now and execute it. Tomorrow is not promised. You're sitting on the couch, you're watching TV, and your life is passing you by. You keep procrastinating over and over. Stop waiting on something to fall out of the sky because it's not. It ain't. And that's it for this video, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope that this helps someone out there for real. As I'm speaking to you, I'm speaking to myself. So don't forget to subscribe to my channel so you can see more videos like this. And let me know if you actually want to see videos like this. Until next time, party people. Peace out. Okay, go sit down. Seriously, go lay down. Go lay down. I love you. Close the door. Thank you.